Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another awesome video on the channel. And in today's video, I wanted to talk about the Ninjago Season 15 sets a little bit more than I have been talking before. Um, so I do hope you guys will um, enjoy it a lot. Um, so yeah, so let's get into it. First off, I do want to say is that I live in the U.S. and the sets come out for me August 1st. I know the sets have been out for everybody else, but since I live in the U.S., I have no way of getting them until August 1st. So if you guys are interested in me reviewing the Lego sets, unboxing the Lego sets, reviewing the minifigures, taking a look at the minifigures. Honestly, like I might even do stop motions with the season 15 minifigures. There's a lot I can do. Please subscribe if you're interested in that type of content. I would really appreciate it if you guys can let me know if you guys will like this type of stuff because I already said that I was going to do it before, but it's going to be a long time now considering it comes out, these sets come out late for me. Um, but yeah, just let me know. Uh, but the next thing I want to talk about them is that um, the sets are really expensive. I don't think I can buy all of the sets. That's literally like all I'm telling you guys right now is that like I'll try my best to scrape the bottom of the barrel and try to be able to get as much money as I can to get these sets and get them so I can review them on the channel for you guys and do everything that I plan for you guys. But I never said that I was getting all of the sets. It's going to be a couple of the sets. And it's going to be a couple of them. And it's going to be very, very expensive. Because if people didn't know, okay, I'll, I'll tell you guys. The first set, Lloyd's Hydro Mech, is $20. The Jay's Super Sub Speeder thing is $40. Okay, Nia Dragon is 70. Okay, the, 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 the Temple of the Endless Sea is 100. And the, uh, the, the Hydro Bounty is $130. Which means if I wanted to get sets that had most of the Ninja minifigures in there, it would cost me a hundred over $100. It's a lot of money, you guys. It's a lot of money, and I, I'm I, I, I'm 14 years old, dude. And seriously, you guys, I'm 14, and my parents don't have a lot of money. So I'm going to try my hardest to get what I can so I can, like, um, post videos for you guys on the channel of the reviews and all of that stuff. So, um... If I do end up having money um, around that time and I do end up having at least $100 so I can buy the sets, most likely what I'll get is Lloyd Hydro Mech, the J Super Sub Speeder thing, and Nia's Dragon. And that would be around $120, uh, roughly around there. So, and that's honestly what I'll have to do, honestly, like, because, like, because, like, because, like, it, 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 it's honestly just weird, and it's honestly just stupid, because here's the thing, here's the thing, you guys, is that I like building the Lego sets, I do, I enjoy building the Lego sets, Okay, but every single part of, of a Lego set, I guarantee you guys, every single person on this planet who likes the Lego sets, literally think of the sets as a bonus. They just want the minifigures. And that's really just the same thing for me, honestly. So yeah, um, I do hope you guys enjoy those videos. Um, 
Most likely, as you guys know, they do come out on August 1st. So, I mean, I'm probably not going to be able to get a video out by August. I, I mean, sorry, by like August 1st when they come out. But at least sometime in that week, I'll be able to build one of the sets and show it off to you guys and stuff like that. And then I'll just build the other one, show it to you that week, and then build the last one and show it to you that week. So I do hope you guys enjoy these videos. Um, again, please sub if you do enjoy the content and you're looking forward to these videos that I'm posting. That's it though. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.